Hello, welcome to Detour Meals, Meals for When Life Takes You on a Detour. I'm your host, Ellie, and this is part of a three-part series where we're going to teach you how to feed four to six people for less than five dollars. Today we're going to be making SOS, which is a meal that was originally conceived in the army that Americans developed and made in their homes. So this is like a low-cost struggle meal. So if you've never had this, you're either not American enough or you're an entitled millennial, both categories which I fit into. So we're going to see how this works out. As usual, we got this recipe from online, so we will have the link to the original recipe down below just in case I make a disastrous mess out of this. We're gonna need a few ingredients, which is a pound of ground beef. We're gonna need two cubes of this chicken bouillon, a half a teaspoon of garlic powder, a half a teaspoon of ground black pepper, and we're gonna need a quarter teaspoon of onion powder, as well as a half a cup of all-purpose flour and one and a half cups of low-fat milk. Now, you normally need like toast or bread for this, but this is a struggle meal and we're gonna use what we got so we have uh, some nice hot dog buns. So first thing is we're gonna take our pound of ground beef. Um, I'm gonna put the two cubes of the chicken bouillon. I don't even know how to pronounce that, but it says to crumble it. Normally you would drain the ground beef, but we are using the fat that's already in this for our roux. Next we're gonna put in our garlic powder, our black pepper, and our onion powder to season the whole thing up. And it's gonna be so scrumptious. SOS is a pretty good struggle meal for when you're trying to ball on a budget cause flour, just the milk, the meat, and all of it. It's not gonna be like the healthiest thing in the world. I don't think uh, Weight Watchers would approve, but it would be filling. So when the army was eating this, it's easier to operate on a full stomach than an empty ravenous one that maybe had a carrot. So now that our meat is brown, we're gonna pour in the flour so it can just like soak up all the fat. And we're gonna let it cook for about three minutes. I'm gonna keep stirring it. And after that, we'll add the milk. This just doesn't seem right. See, I think of flour and I think like, oh, I'm gonna bake stuff, not like, oh, I'm gonna get flour and stir it into my ground beef. Like, that sounds like a good idea. And we're gonna put in our milk and bring it down to a simmer for five minutes. And then it's supposed to be so good. I hope you're not lactose intolerant or you're really struggling. So this is finished. We're gonna bring our shingles back to the table. Um, remember, it's hot dog buns, because um, we're working with what we got, so that's fine. And it's time for just something tasty. This is our delicious SOS. Oh, guys, that's, that's so nasty. That's like, it smells good. I will, t I like, I'm not trying to be super dramatic. It does smell good. <laughs> okay, so apparently I've gotten word that I'm being a bit selfish with my SOS portioning. <laughs> this is so gross. Tyler, I have a special treat for you. Come here. Yeah. So we just put a detour in Tyler's day and we're going to make him eat this. Yo, no, have at it. I'm, I'm just so proud of what I made. It is fresh off what the stove. What else is in here? Is this gonna be like super hot? No, it's not gonna be spicy at all. It might be temperature hot. Am I getting punked? Get some bread, you gotta get some bread with it. I'm, I'm gonna eat it with you. Take a bite first. No. I, I don't trust y'all, am I getting punked? Okay. You're not getting punked. Mmm. Oh, good? <laughs> yeah, it's actually really good. This detour in my day was a blessing in disguise, guys. Would you eat this again? Would you like me to make you this? Yeah, this would be great. I'd eat this again. Thank you, Tyler. Go back. <laughs> All right, guys. So now I have finished making SOS. Did I cry SOS? No. So I want to see you make it with your CG. Um, if you do make it, please make sure to take a picture, show us on Instagram, show us on Facebook, leave a comment down below and tell us how it went. But first and foremost, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, 
So like it down below, you can subscribe, you can hit the bell so that way you get a notification every time we post so you can see more content like this. Thanks so much, bye.